Hello fellow customizers, today I'm customizing a Keith Haring inspired wallet. Keith Haring is very popular here in Tokyo, all over Japan. In fact, you can find everything from shoes to jackets to t-shirts with the Keith Haring print on them. I was left inspired to paint my own Keith Haring wallet. With the holidays right around the corner, you can use the techniques in this video to paint any type of pop art you want on any surface you have available to you. And as always, if you like watching these videos, be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and also leave a comment down below and let me know what you are currently customizing. I rescued this wallet from the garbage and there is a tiny bit of damage on a couple of the corners, however that is easily camouflaged with the paint. While I am unsure if this is actual leather, I am treating it exactly like leather by first removing the factory finish using the Leather Prepare and Deglazer from Angelus Direct. My base coat is flat black, also from Angelus Direct. All of the artwork done today will be done entirely freehand using only a paintbrush. But that's one of the main things that attracts me to the Keith Haring style. It is very free, it is very easy, and it is very light, so I am not scared of making any mistakes with wavy lines today. I do not want to leave this pure black and white, so I am using some blue turquoise to color in one of the characters.
And I chose Lilac for the other character. The first layers are completely dry you can go in with a second coat to fill in any negative spots and you know i am not going to neglect the back side of the wallet that is the perfect size for another keith herring piece Tidying up a few of my white lines. The final touch on this wallet is a matte four coat urethane finish. And this is the complete Keith Haring inspired wallet. Believe it or not, you can hold more than just cat treats in this. Try holding quarters or yen in fact. If you have any questions, all of my contact information is down below as are links to all the products I used in this video. Big thanks to Endless Direct for the paints and thanks guys for watching.